this hits really, really close to home uh, for us. You know, Robin and I have been married for 42 years. We've been together for 45 years. And uh, her older sister, Cindy, mm -hmm. which she is always described as her person, yeah. that person in this world that she could talk to and, right. and tell anything. Um, back in 2002, she was driving down the highway at like 4 o'clock in the morning and some idiotic moron at an overpass waited for the car to come through and dropped a two-gallon vat of acid on her car and it went through her windshield and doused her body and People. she got burns over 80% of her body. I'm so sorry. Uh, Robin, have you ever known a more traumatic thing for somebody to go through? Oh, no, I've, I haven't. I've never, ever known anything or anyone to go through anything like that. Uh, and of course, no one deserves that. But uh, she, she went through that and never, ever one time said, why me? Every time I was ever in her presence, I knew I was in the presence of the most powerful and strongest woman I have ever known. She was determined to conquer her surgeries. She went through over 35 reconstructive surgeries. She lived for years, two years at least, with the tissue expanders, uh, skin grafts. Her mouth was fused for over a year. She had to take little tiny bites. She had a fear of always choking, but you never knew it. She was truly the strongest, most determined woman. She was not gonna let anyone take her life from her that she had worked so hard for. She was a single mother. She raised three beautiful children, three beautiful daughters. She was a grandmother. And she was just determined to live the life that she had created and worked so hard for. I, she was my hero. And I was always so proud of her. Awesome. Um, I can't even begin to imagine a 10-year-old child going through what you've gone through. And everybody needs help with this.